Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Maker Fair and the Power Racing Series. Brought to you by Liquid Wrench. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Power Racing Series. What is that you say? This is a racing series where we race coast to coast. We take those little tiny toy cars that you give your kids that they race for, I don't know, a season or two, right? Then they go out of it and you throw it away. That's right, we take those things and we make them better, stronger, faster, so much better than they were before. We modify them, we hack them, we make them $500 racing machines. That's right, every single one of these vehicles was built for less than $500. That's right, because that's what you can do when you got some spare time and some ingenuity. All of these teams have come across from all across the U.S. Right now, the, the front of the grid, we have two teams. Phantom and Cartastrophe, both from Illinois. Cartastrophe is actually leading in the points right now, but qualified second, so he's right behind the Phantom, who is the fastest car out here, but hasn't been doing so well in race conditions. In third place right now in the standings is the cow car, way over there in the back of the field. He's there because of Moxie. What's Moxie you say? That is you. You are Moxie. Right now there's a Moxie board going on there right now, traveling. There it is. The Moxie board over by our merchandise tent. Our merchandise tent where we have fantastic t-shirts, posters, stickers, and more available for sale. Over there. Yeah, go ahead. Go, go through the crowd now, Moxie board. And on the Moxie board, there's a button, and for each team, and you're going to vote for your favorite team. So you're going to vote for as many teams and as often as you like. We call it Chicago-style voting. <laughs> so whenever a team does something awesome that you like, go ahead and give them a vote. That's right. These votes turn into points, real race points. So it's not just race points that they do out here on the grid. It's also vote points right here. That's right, because even if you're slow, you can still win by being awesome. Because that is the Power Racing Series way. And right now we're going to have a sprint lap. That's right, a sprint of 30 laps. Each of these teams are going to go around for 30 laps as fast as they can to win not only points, but your hearts as well. We got teams with lights and horns. Maybe some silly string, who knows what. And tape. All these cars are put together with tape. And some glue sticks. And a whole lot of cross fingers. That's right. And it looks like they're all decked out in rain gear because it might get a little drizzly here. All right, now. Let's get this show on the road here. All right, Patrick. I'm looking here on the grid right now. I see drivers that seem to be very ready right now. They're honking their horns because they want to get going right now. They seem pretty excited. And if you were here just a couple hours ago, boy, did we have a great show for you. Cartastrophe and Phantom have been neck and neck this entire round, but don't count out Milwaukee Makerspace or Omaha Makers Goods with their kit car. Don't ever count out the Lone Hacker, ever. Never, ever forget Lone Hacker, a great national hero here with his national hero hat. But without much further ado, Track Marshals, are you ready to go? Let's get a thumbs up from all the marshals. You awake? Wakey, all of them. Drivers, are you ready? Yep, that sounds like they're ready. All right, Patrick. Let's get a countdown going. I'm going to be ready everybody's now. Everybody's help with this one. Prepare to race. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And they are. Go, go, go. That's about racing. Participants in the third. They got them. They got them for the first time. Second place, the Phantom. Catastrophe's in the lead and Benicar in third place. OMG, fourth place, Milwaukee Makers Space in fifth. And the golf cart has continued on. And we have a uh, caution out right now. Caution is out right now.
If we can get the pace car out right now, for one extra lap around, seem to have a technical difficulty with the uh, moisture. We thought we had it sorted out, but just in a moment. I don't know if I can keep up with the pace car. Right now, you're, you're technically leading at this rate. <laughs> judgingly to make sure sorry that he presses the button right for that false start but false start on my fault are you sure it wasn't the connection though yeah it was that all right all right we're gonna have to do this one more time patrick i'm very sorry cartastri is very upset with you they were having a great start. So sorry. Moxie points still count though. Moxie's still going. Yes, the Moxie board is still alive and active. That's so the board should have broken. No, they're getting it back underway. We'll let Milwaukee get back onto grid there. Which means all the more reason for more rain to show up. I don't know, we got Kyle Car and Milwaukee, the uh, Lotosaurus Rex is still broken. Go, go! Woo! They don't seem to be able to get it running, Patrick. We're going to have to start without them. Alright, we're going to have to start without them. Alright, this time... Okay, let's make this work this time. Let's make it really work this very time. Sorry, very sorry. <laughs> Alright, All right, let's count down for 10 again. This time, our task tree, if you could just do exactly what we did mean. last lap. Just saying. That looked pretty brilliant. So... Without much further ado, Patrick, lead us off. Here we go, prepare to race. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It's working! Yay! And Cartastrophe is uh, paying up for that one. And it looks like CC Casey was able to get back on the track because of that. Right there. Milwaukee's Iron Rose. Oh, the wheel completely damaged. Oh, unfortunate. Both of Milwaukee's cars with trouble right now. To be fair, they do have three cars, and right now, that white little golf cart is their hope. Give them all the moxie that you can give. And we are back underway. Phantom, catastrophe, one, two, right there. The track is starting to get wet. And Phantom trying to make its way through lap traffic, getting a little hectic back there. But now pulling a much more comfortable lead. Cartastro being second place, and Venico fighting with three wide down the front straightaway. Oh, he kicked it too far, and Venico into the wall. Oh, and Cartastro also getting some tire marks all over the back of it. Looks like the Moxie's working for overall meter best to kick on. Look at the crowd effects on that machine right now. And right now, Phantom is able to pull through the traffic and hold on. But Cartastrophe is still in second place. Okay. 
the FCC KC able to make up for lost time. They are still putting laps down. Bent the car into the wall. Yeah, again. And it's holding up the second place car. That's no good. They gotta get him out of there. The track is getting slicker. And they are still charging on. That, those lights are starting to become functional on the track. <laughs> Unbelievably, though, Phantoms being able to avoid all the troubles that any of the other cars have made it through. And attrition setting in. Unfortunately, the golf cart gonna have to take them all again. Omaha Maker Group still going strong. The last Milwaukee car, the golf cart is still going. At this rate, it will finish seventh place ahead of two cars. Unbelievable. Anything's possible here. I'm getting crunching in the back. I don't even know. Oh! now is slid into the wall. Those track conditions are definitely costing their time in the corner. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're seeing a lot of sliding oh, going on. Oh, catching up the phantom now. That's right, Patrick. You are absolutely correct. First and second are yet again on top of each other. CC Casey's got to get room for a second place car. Let him through. Because we have another battle brewing. The wrong happened though. Who's he gonna push next? And they're sliding, they're going as wide as they can. They both take the tire wall. And the second place car is collected. That's great news for Phantom Power Racing. That is everything they needed to know. Right now, all Phantom has to do is stay out of trouble. The cheering for the Lucky Maker Spaces golf cart is overwhelming. And they're actually in a very solid four, uh, fifth place. No, no, sorry, my mistake. Third place. Long Hacker's currently in fifth. Very solid fifth place for Long Hacker. The Phantom is keeping it out of trouble. That is really seems to be the story today. It's not necessarily speed, though, that did help him get on pole. But right now, Cartastrophe has some distance farther away from them. Mostly because of a couple incidences. And now the rain is definitely coming down. The cars are going to get looser. Phantom making a bold move in that lap traffic. Desperately trying to make up for time to make sure Cartas Free doesn't catch him. And there's a lot of cars in the back of the field right now. They're getting bunched up because they all have to slow down for this rain in order to make it through these turns. Let Milwaukee's trying to get through. The way to walk, oh, and CCK into the sidewall, cut off by catastrophe. And right now, first and second, still Phantom and catastrophe. John is trying to push the car further using his own weight. 18 laps complete. Cartastri still a couple seconds down from them. Certainly not out of this race. But now the rain is increasing. It is definitely getting wetter out here. I hope they put all weather tires on those cars. It is coming down really good now. This is probably the most rain we've ever had during a race. We are definitely back. No, this is not the most rain. The New York was definitely in 2012 was our heaviest rain race, but it's starting to compete for us. Meanwhile, the leaders are bunching up. Ten laps to go, ten laps to go. With just ten laps to go, Cartastrophe is now right next to Phantom Power Racing, making its way through. And a lawmaker group, they're out of power. They need to get off of the track. What's going on? The lights are running, but what's with... Nobody's following. 
Contastery and Phantom still one and two. They're right on the Contastery, right on their bumper. And now just nine laps, and the whole lane is really coming down. Another lap for the golf cart. everywhere. 